You know the bottom line, there's just so many storylines coming into Super Bowl 57, but it's the first one ever to have brothers playing for each team, and not just playing, they're two of the best at their respective positions. Kansas City's All-Pro tight end Travis Kelsey is two years younger than his brother Jason, the All-Pro center for the Eagles, and Greg Olson, these two aren't just good football players, they've got great personalities and neither one is afraid to show it. Well, that's for sure, Kurt. And, you know, those strong personalities that we've seen from both of them, they come from their parents, Donna and Ed. They raised these two All-Pros in Cleveland Heights, Ohio. And as for much as Travis likes to follow in big brother Jason's footsteps, regardless of the final score today, this outcome will be bittersweet for one of them. Kelsey's got it! Touchdown! Jason Kelsey fired up the Kelsey Brothers Bowl, whatever you want to call it, leading up to the championship game. So I'm going to take you back. Thanksgiving, we're on a production call. And I'm like, hey, Trav, you ever think about playing your brother this year in the Super Bowl? And you're like, no, nah, man. Since that day to today, like, could you describe what this has been like? I'll tell you what. It's always kind of been in the back of our mind because he's on an NFC team. I'm on an AFC team. It's always been like, yeah, we'll meet up at the mountaintop, right? I'll tell you what, you couldn't have scripted it any better, man. I'm in rare form. Y'all still on the ground. Take us back to like your big brother, he's little brother. What kind of little brother is he growing up? It's like, is he a pain in the ass? Is he, he was for sure a pain in the ass at times. <laughs> Antagonistic would be a great word. That's how I you mean, know you're a good little brother right there. Yeah, I think that's part of the reason he's a really good player, is he had to learn all these tricks being smaller and younger. He's mastered the head games now. I mean, he, <laughs> sitting in the backseat with this guy on a road trip, uh, poking me, and immediately when I go to punch him or hit him, my dad's screaming, what you, stop fighting back there, Jason, what are you doing back there? I'm like, Imagine that household up in Cleveland Heights with Travis and Jason. They must have just torn that place up. So, Trav, having Jason as the big brother, was there one moment that sticks out? Honestly, it was through my entire life, man. I knew this guy was doing the right things. I went to the University of Cincinnati because he was there, and then I followed his footsteps into the league and getting drafted by the same head coach. He did all the all the real hard work. I, I'm coming in like a flanker, just like a little brother, just easy as can be. Sorry, you're, you're like been blocking for him. That's, that's... <laughs> Jason Kelsey, if you stand behind that guy, and you're going to find yourself in some pretty good places. Is there like a moment as the big brother where you had to deliver some news that he might not have wanted to hear? Early on in his career at Cincinnati, he came to me and he's all pissed off. He's like, man, I'm better than these other guys. I should be playing more. And I'm like, bro, you want to get more playing time? Go out there and prove you're the best. Go out there and prove you're better than everybody else. Stop being, you know, the guy that complains about everything and, and do something about it. Travis Kelsey finds the end zone. I'm going to show you a picture here, and I just want your first reaction. <laughs> we looked exactly the same in our face. <laughs> so good. Like, I'm just scowling with my eyebrows. Oops. And then Travis's look right here, this was, like, all growing up. This that's, is the Travis Kelsey special. That's still my look. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you guys have both celebrated a Super Bowl with each other. This one's a little different. Can you even anticipate your first reaction either side of the coin? That, it's, a, it's an awkward feeling, man. It's going to be a lot of a mixed emotion. Because uh, yeah. we're going to see the guys on our team absolutely going nuts. And then uh, we're going we're gonna to feel for the guy across the ball that, uh, that didn't get it. When you win a Super Bowl, it's an intense amount of like individual gratification. And when you watch a brother win one or a loved one win one, it's like this incredibly outward happiness for somebody else. We're going to feel both of those at the same time, I bet. Yeah. And I, I don't know quite how that's going to go yet. Wish you both great success. I know it can't go both ways, but this, this was awesome. Thanks a lot, Greg. I appreciate, appreciate it. it. It's always fun, brother.